Smoke poured from the Parma Theater just after 5 o'clock this evening. Flames engulfed the theater lobby, said Doug Turner with the Parma Fire Department. A passerby took this photo. This fire started in the theater. It spread from there. Yeah, there was fire inside and a lot of smoke. The landmark theater started showing movies in 1936. It closed in September. Just last night, a group of citizens met at another location to talk about how to breathe new life into this historic theater. It's a sad state of affairs here for the theater. Dresses, I put them in my trunk. Dorina Forder alters wedding dresses and her shop connected to the theater. She started throwing wedding dresses out the front door. She saved a few, but 50 still inside. I tried to get out as much as I could, but it wasn't much because the smoke was coming in really, really quick and I started to choke. Some of the dresses are for weddings tomorrow. It's tomorrow and next weekend and every weekend. So I feel really, really bad for my customers. I've been here for 11 years and I've been doing great. And I don't know what to tell you. I don't know if somebody did this or who tried to do something or if the theater got on fire by itself, that's hard to believe. The theater's owner said he was just there last week. About four or five days ago, I went and set the thermostats about 48, 50 degrees in case it got real cold for the water lines and everything. Other than that, it's been locked up for two months. A crowd gathered to watch firefighters save the building. Many saw their first movie here. Many memories. I went on my first date here as well. and. Again, it has a lot of sentimental values. In Parma, Paul Kiska, News Channel 5.